Uh, ladies and gentlemen, of all the comedians in my peer group, I am the youngest. And I am thrilled and delighted to be here to celebrate birthdays, but it is very depressing to me to see them getting older and more forgetful. You know the guys I'm talking about. I, I can't remember their names. <laughs> comedian and a fine actor, but Milton is an arranger, a producer, a director, a dictator. <laughs> My favorite Milton Berle story happened several years ago when Barbara Sinatra called me and invited me down to Palm Springs. Frank Sinatra was going to be the chairman of an evening at Temple Isaiah and they wanted to do an all-comedy show, and Barbara thought they would pick the three best comedians they knew, and she invited Milton Berle, Jan Murray, and me. False modesty has never been one of my assets. I don't believe it. Anyway, we were invited down for the weekend. We got there on Friday. Friday evening, Frank cooked for us. He made spaghetti. It was delicious and, and very reasonable. Uh, <laughs> And Saturday morning, bright and early, Milton got up and went over to the temple to check out the room. At 4.30 in the afternoon, he came back. And we were waiting for lunch, we were waiting all day for him. And I said, Milton, what happened? He said, don't ask. It was disaster. It was unbelievable. They had chairs set up like in a theater. They had a little small aisle down the middle. They had a small stage, no sound, no lights, no drapes. It was terrible and I made them change everything, and I stayed there, and I watched them do it. I put in tables and chairs, I put in a big stage, I set it up like a nightclub, I made them change the sound and the drapes and put in lights, and it's going to be perfect. I said, gee, that's great, thank you. And that night, Frank and Barbara took us out to Dominic's in Palm Springs, and we went to Dominic's for dinner, and several people came over to say hello to everybody, and one man said, Norm, he said, we're so excited about your show, we can't wait to see your show. And did you hear what happened at the temple today? And I said, no. He said, somebody came in and changed the whole room, moved the chair. I said, well, Milton did that. He's setting it up for our show. He said, your show is tomorrow night. There was a wedding there today. <laughs> stories and all of them involve Milton Berle and, and, and we are all of us who know him so thrilled and so proud to be friends with Milton Berle. I know it's a highlight in my life. Milton, God bless you. Happy birthday. From everybody.